I'm Camille Smithick. <laughs> um, I live in Manchester now, but I'm originally from the Wirral. And uh, I'm an artist and illustrator. When I'm getting inspirations for ideas and themes of what to draw and, and things like that, it's usually ideas I'm getting from reading books. Um, I like to read like quite a wide range of books, some sort of philosophy, some sort of popular science. Um, and then my desk where I work is in the living room, so the TV's on, usually I like overhear little bits of what's on the news or adverts, or just maybe just some words or a sentence or an opinion might just trigger some sort of idea. And then the ideas and things that I'm reading around, I sort of tie it all together. Um, but sort of visual inspiration, a lot of work that I like. I like a lot of medieval illuminations. I like those strange little drawings that the monks were doing <laughs> by candlelight. I like the combination of the humour and the sort of serious um, religious meaning that they were trying to find. So the best piece of advice I've ever been given, um, I think it was probably quite recently when I was working on this one and um, it was from a boyfriend and I was getting all like stressed out thinking, oh, <laughs> what am I doing? But he was just like, you just have to enjoy it. It's supposed to be fun. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> so that was probably the best piece of advice, just to uh, <laughs> relax and, uh, and enjoy it. I'd say just keep doing the work, you know, just keep drawing whenever you get the chance um, and then gradually it, you'll develop your own style because you're looking at your work and saying, oh I don't like that bit, or I don't like that bit, or I need to do a bit something a bit more colourful, bring it together. And sometimes I think it's intimidating when you're first starting out doing things, like sometimes I look back at, at the first sort of illustrations that I did and just think, oh, <laughs> they're terrible, that's not the style that I wanted to have. <laughs> um, but it doesn't matter, it gave me the experience to learn that. Whereas if I, so I think it's just not having any, um, just going for it, just doing any illustration job that you can at first. And then just, just doing as much as you can. And then your work will develop into how you want it to, you know, your own voice and style, I guess, will develop. <laughs>